So we have... There's something here. What is this? Contact beam? Heavy duty energy projector. Asteroid cutter. Primary fire. Equip. Let's see if we can equip it there. Holy crap! Uh, okay. Contact energy. I, I really need a bigger inventory. Also, I have a lot of ammo. Contact energy. I'm thinking I'm going to start maybe storing some stuff. Hole plus primary fire. Because otherwise, it's not going to be good. Um, I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna put the contact energy. I mean the contact beam, we are going to put this one where this Ripper was. Because the Ripper was interesting for fighting that big monster. But I prefer this thing. Okay, so. Uh, okay, partially consumed, apparently. Someone came from over here. Heard whispers. Okay, we got the contact beam. Let's go over here. Oh. What is that? Mining administration. Jesus Christ. I try to impale you with one of the things from your body. Jesus. Oh. The rudeness, you know, the rudeness. And you took a bunch of my health. The crap. Okay, well, I guess we're gonna use this one. I did not intend for that to happen with just two jackasses. Okay, so... Gravity plating is ma maintenance. Please try later, no technicians available. Gravity plating is kinda screwed up. Like, you can tell because of the lightning. Clearance confirmed. Okay. Yeah, we need to go for it. So, give me this. There's a golden semiconductor there. That went like boo. I wonder if it opens something. Yep, it opened this one. Anything else? Some, some, some computers here. That's monies. Oh, it's a level two. So we can open this. Thank you. Thank you much. Appreciate it. Open it. Oh. You should confirm my clearance and open all in the same thing. It's not necessary for me to just press twice. That is just bad UI.
Text log. Mining administration log. Trying to work out how fast they spread. The flight desk was the first to go, probably thanks to the shuttle crash. Most of the medical is overrun, losing ground by the hour. Engineering can be far behind. No word from cargo or communications, so we're not expecting anything but bad news when we do. Best hope seems to be the mining deck. Dallas says the infrastructure down there is still running. But if it took out security that fast, how long can we hold out? Oh, I don't know. Another node. Now we have nodes. Yep, we have enough nodes. check something about the map here mm. there's a thing here which is what we need there is no okay there's something over there no I'm not seeing any any stores or any workbenches in this area I also don't have any power for my stasis. And that is a problem. Okay, these two guys are hanging out here. Hey, how's it hanging? Anything cool? No? There's some guts over here, but it's no big banana. Okay, what do we have? Oh, this! This is what I was looking for. Thank you. It did not show on the map before I got it. Interesting. Okay, suit. So, we're going to go with this, which increases the stasis energy. And we're going to with this, which is increases hit. Nice. What is this door? Stasis duration and uh, interesting. Air duration. A a oxygen. Okay. So now we should have even more health. That is a good thing. Credits. Get over here. What is this? What is that? Credits? Give me the credits! Uh, what? Look at this, there's a box that you can grip. Is there anything back here? No. You're seeing racks after racks. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring the box if at all possible. We might need to just box someone. Okay, that, that's a bad sound. Okay. They're getting cooked there. Nice. Jackass babies. Anybody else? Okay, it's a good thing that you get cooked. Bro, your feet scared the crap out of me. Okay, well, like half a person. Half the person you used to be. Let me see over here. Got some credits. Got some... Yeah. Got some stuff. Oh, that was Spanish. But I could not make out what she was saying. But it was Spanish. I caught a couple of words.
Okay. What do we have here? Up. Scan rig to unlock station. Hey, you have nice windows here. So, circuit breaker. I'm gonna guess we turn off this one. And we turn it on on the ADS cannons. Good, thank you, Gladys. Just got an update. Power diverted from mining administration network. That's yes. two. One more system and we'll have power for the ADS. Okay. Hopefully, once we do the ADS, we're going to be able to just... Because I never went to the water thing. And I don't know if I screwed that up. I hope I did not lock myself out of something. Got any interlopers over here? I'm gonna switch to the rifle a little bit. Yep. Jesus Christ. How much do I need to... I'm shooting you in the link, you stupid thing. That was not good. I lost a lot of health and a lot of ammo. It's something that should have been a standard operating procedure encounter. These guys are getting heavier. Buy one of these. Okay. How much ammo do we have now? Okay, we got a couple hundred. Maybe we go back to this one. Is there anything else back here? Just a cup of coffee there. Stupid monsters. Okay, let's see. Coffee there. Reroute power systems. Let me see in my. If there's anything else? No, I guess we just go back the way we came in. Hey, hang in there. Okay, everything has been accounted for here, so we're good. You dead? Thank you, Gladys. It's a little bit of pieces of necromorphs falling from the sky. Stupid space zombies. Anything here? No. Welcome to the Mining Administration. Concordia Extraction Corporation. A whale and utility division. Building better worlds. Okay, close, close. Vacuum. Thank you, Gladys. I'm just gonna go ahead and save real quick. There you go. No, I wanna. Okay. So, where do we go now? Third floor? Third floor. Look at this. We're very shiny right now. Very, very shiny. I guess we got some sort of... Uh, I guess we got some sort of, uh, you know, like, necro goo polish. Also, there was like a screen. Ishimura S Ship Systems Department. Okay, where do you have like a waiting room over here? A lot of people coming to the system department. Systems are not very operational, if you ask me. Connection lost. Exactly. Someone needs to get down here and fix the, the system department things. 
because there's no systems. Save. It is important to save. Uh, computer core connection. Okay. Break room. Limited space. No congregating. Oh, you don't want people congregating in the break room. They might, you know, take a break. Okay, so there's a thing close there, another there. You see here, there's something there, something here. And we go round and round and round until that thing. Pretty straightforward. No congregating. Oh, look at this. They were congregating here. You can tell because of the candles and the circle. And the... Look at this. This What's is a video that? A marker. Recording? Huh. Must be the marker they dug up. So yep. it is the Savior. That marker. That's the symbol of the Church of Unitology. Yep. Didn't take you for a believer, Isaac. My mother was. But if they found this on some alien planet... What does that mean? That Unitology's onto something? Unitology's full of shit. Forget it. Huh? Feet, hands, eight, or infinity, I'm going to guess. Yep, this is the marker, you see? This could be also like a maybe a cool thumbnail. If we manage to get it. Like there, you see? Or a little bit over that. The marker. Something like that. Uh, okay, can I take a get a cup of, cup of coffee? No. United we send. Is Unitology New Hope or just another scam? You've been living on Mars for the past 200 years. You might have missed the fastest growing religion movement in history. Unitology boasts a following of millions, counts powerful CEOs and officials in its ranks, claims 78 billion buckaroos of stock in multi global companies, owns two of Earth's largest financial institutions. GPSG Financial and Unitas Energy Investments. From its beginning as a cult of personality, Unitology has become a respected, established religion. Most people know the basics. 200 years ago, Michael Oldman, a respected geophysicist, blew the whistle on what he claimed would be to be the biggest cover-up ever instituted by Earth government. The discovery of an artifact, or marker, which proved beyond any doubt that there is alien life in the universe. The government labeled Oldman a cook, but his uh, claims stuck a cor uh, chord uh, with some, and his mysterious death soon afterward fueled the interest, along with civil unrest and demand for action. Unitologists believed the market contained a code, the key to eternal life, through rebirth and ascension to heaven. The kicker is you have to die first. They say the government is hiding the marker somewhere, keeping it secret for themselves. Across all of human space, Unitologists praise Almond's martyrdom and wait the day God comes uh, to take them to their new life beyond death. It all sounds pretty harmless, but like any cult, there's a dark side. Unitologists are ranked in the church. Nobody ever talks about it, but most of the critics believe that there are at least three ranks above the average believer or initiate. With each new rank, more of the church's inner workings and research is revealed to a follower. These ranks are achieved by one simple criteria, giving money and power to the church. Interesting, that sounds familiar. Think taking all your monies back? Uh, uh, the church also requires their members to donate their bodies after death. Why? What do they do with them? Nobody will say. And attempts to infiltrate the inner circle have failed. With their emphasis on transformation and rebirth, maybe we wouldn't like the answer even if they told us. One rumor that also refuses to die says the church is funding a secret shipbuilding program. Some claim to have seen the fleet. No documentary evidence has been supplied. But the claimants all say this mostly on ships, despite their huge size. Continued on page nine, uh, 94. 
Mm. So you see, they are gathering bodies for when they discover the marker because the marker uses dead matter. So they will be reborn as necromorphs. Interesting. So out there there's a fleet of mausoleum ships filled with corpses ready to be taken over by the necromorph infestation. Oh, look at this. This guy is hanging out there. Thank you. Okay, can we enter this through here? I think I saw there was a door. Locked. Okay, storage. So how do I enter that? There's a, a boom boom thing there. Electrical systems. Palms access. Maybe in the electrical systems. As I see, maybe good loot inside. This is locked. Can we get some stuff from over here? Like, bro, can you move over there? Maybe I stomp on you a little bit? No? See this. No. Ah! That worked. I had a feeling it was something like that. Ooh, level, level three, three of security clearance required. I know, Gladys. Ooh, weapon upgrade. Stasis recharge. It was about time. I have not seen one of those in like six levels. Level three security clearance required. Ah, screw you. Level three security clearance required. Let me see something. Is there a store nearby? There's a save over there. Something over here that's locked. Something over here that's locked and that one. Okay. So, first of all... Okay, I got I got turned around. We need to go over here, then to the right, and there's a save point. We're gonna go to this save point. Activate the save point. Save. Now we go in this direction. And we do the thing. I'm gonna keep that over there in case there is uh, some interlopers coming later. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate they leaving random boxes of. Yeah. Fry, you stupid thing. Yeah, what? Okay. Gotta be careful with the plating here. Okay, one second. How do I move this? There's a ladder there. How am I supposed to get there? Is there something we can move? Okay, so we gotta make a run for it. Not cool. So you. Okay, anybody else? Inventory full, damn it. Uh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. This is not a good situation. I guess what we could do 
Okay, let's see if we can re reload everything. Everything seems to be reloaded. No, maybe now we can. Not in the trade point. I would rather sacrifice this. Drop it. Okay. Oh, we, we, we can we can pick them up later. Use this. And use that. Get a little bit of health. And now we can take the blades. Okay. No problem. Blast my energy. Do I shoot some people with this? Should we try it? I want to try it. Okay, who's coming? Oh, I saw you. <laughs> See, you got some energy. You gotta, you gotta keep it pressed. You see? This actually does a lot of damage. Okay, anybody around? Oh. No. Oh, you stupid baby necro. Not bad. Okay, where, where are we supposed to go? Yeah, this way. Careful with the platings. Let's just say escape in this direction. There's a wall. Poorly labeled, if you ask me. Also, let me see something. This could be like a cool thumbnail as well. You see? The energy. Huh. Moment. Apply. Okay. Stasis recharge. I have not used stasis, I guess. Stasis back. Huh? It's been a while since we had one of these. These guys. I saw the vulnerable parts now. Come on, bro. That's good. Okay. He dead? I think he dead. Thank you for the node. Also, you took a chunk out of me and my health. I will apply a bandage. I really need more like level 3 bandages. Stupid thing. Okay. What do we have in terms of firepower? Yeah. That one is dry. The energy projector we had was dry. So we're going to move weapon this one to... Oh no, this is there. And we're going to use the ripper thing. On the dark roads of Montana There's a shadow in the dirt the whisper of a mountaineer in a ragged flannel shirt He walks the stony hillsides 
with his mandolin in hand But you'll never see his face around this long forgotten land